Midland Beach resident Cosmo Zingaropoli's basement flooded during Hurricane Sandy. In the days after the storm, the sink in his gutted basement clogged and stopped working. Zingaropoli called Frank Urkel of HD Draining the night after Thanksgiving, hoping to have him clean it out the next morning. Instead, Urkel went to Zingaropoli's house that night and cleared the drain. When Urkel saw how badly the Midland Beach home had been hit by the storm, he decided to waive his $100 fee. He says, I'm just doing a good deed because he goes, I could see just by looking around that you've been through a lot and I'm not going to give you no, uh, no bill. Some people are in really bad shape. Um, the neighborhoods are in bad shape. Just all going to help out. Zinger Rapoli isn't the only one Urkel has helped during the cleanup. He says when he sees houses that were badly damaged by the storm, he's happy to work for free in order to help the owners get back on their feet. You go a little, little step further than what you would normally do, but um, the neighborhood, it, it looks kind of like a war zone and it's in bad shape. Zinger Rapoli says after all he's been through in Sandy's aftermath, he's grateful for Urkel's generosity. I was willing to pay anything at that time. I mean, I had to get my house cleaned up and he went above and beyond. It, it's unexpected when you, you do something for free for somebody. They, 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 they don't know how to react to it and they're very surprised. And I think a lot of surprises are happening on Staten Island. A lot of people are helping out more than normal, I guess, circumstances. And so for taking it upon himself to help Sandy victims fix their sinks and get their homes back together, Frank Urkel is our Staten Islander of the week. John Weinstein, New York One.